Good morning. Good morning. Good morning to you. Good morning. Five. How do you do? Good morning, guys. How's everybody feeling? Excellent. I hope you're feeling great. All right, let's go into our morning circle. We are in the month of June. You guys should be able to spell June yourself. Let's spell it. I'm not going to help you. You do it by yourself. Here we go. Got it. June, right? All right. <clears throat> what day of the week is it? So, yesterday was Thursday. If yesterday was Thursday, then today must be Friday. And what do we do on Fridays? We do a Friday dance. Let me see a Friday dance. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, do a Friday dance. Oh, do a Friday dance. Do a Friday dance. And why do we celebrate Fridays? Because it tomorrow will be the weekend, right? It's the last day of the school week. We don't do school work on Friday, on Saturdays and Sundays. So we celebrate on Fridays, right? So today is Friday, <clears throat> and what number will it be? Hmm, let's see. So we have the number for Saturday here too, right? So let's see if we can do a thinking of a number with this, with the date. So we know that yesterday was 11, and tomorrow is 13. So what's a number that's smaller than 13? but bigger than 11. What number goes in the middle? 12. 12 is larger or greater or more than 11, right? Ooh. And But it is smaller or less than 13, right? So today is Friday the 12th. And tomorrow will be Saturday the 13th. All right. Great. Let's go into our how many now. So let's see. How many do we see here? One, two, three, four, five. Five red dots. Okay, let's practice on our hands again. So we have five red dots. Everybody show me five fingers. Easy, right? Just one hand. We have five fingers, five red dots. But what if I added one more red dot? Can you show me what that would look like? How would one more red dot look like on, what would one more red dot look like on your fingers? Can you show me how that would look on your fingers? Add one more. It would be this, right? So if I added one more red dot, how many red dots would we have? We would have one, two, three, four, five, six. There would be six red dots. Five plus one more equals six. Let's see. Let's go to our how many now to make sure. So we have five red dots. And if we add one more, it would be Six. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six. Awesome. All right, friends. So let's go into our unit. We are still talking about transformation, right? Transformation, which is how things change. So today we should do something fun and yummy, right? Uh, so we're going to do that activity today. And we're gonna see how we can tra transform milk to ice cream, okay? I'll see you guys in the next video.